Hello little artists, I'm Mariana Olson and today we are drawing a... A Minecraft Axolotl Are you ready? Yes, I am ready <laughs> <laughs> Let's do this Okay, we're gonna need paper, something to color with and using markers and something to draw with I will use a black marker that you can change for a pencil Hello little artist, today my son Mateo is with me Mateo, can you say hi? Hi! Mateo is seven years old, so Mateo is gonna tell us the joke of the day. Go ahead, Mateo. What, what kind of key opens a banana? What? What kind? A monkey. <laughs> oh, that was a good one. Okay, we're gonna start this picture by doing the face, and the face is facing to the right. So we're gonna start here, not on the center of the paper, we're gonna move over a little bit to the right and we're gonna put a little dot. Now we're gonna do a line that goes diagonal to the left and it's gonna look like this. From the point, I'm gonna go up a little bit, just a little bit. Yep, that's it. And then we're gonna go to the right a little longer than this. So it's gonna look like this. I'm going to the right, like that. Good job. Now from the point, I wanna go down, 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 and you can even put another dot. Yeah, <laughs> you're gonna trace a line, good job. Okay, now we're gonna do the exact same thing we did here, now here, okay? But first, I wanna go down, 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 and this time we're gonna put a dot here, just so we know where we're going. And then we're gonna join this line to the dot, Good job. We're gonna join these two lines doing a diagonal line like this. Perfect. This time we're gonna do the line, this line, but just halfway. So it's just gonna be a short line like this, just half. And from here, I'm gonna do a rectangle shape that goes to the right. So it's gonna look like this. I'm gonna start here with a line. And then we're gonna do a rectangle shape like this. Perfect. In behind this rectangle shape, like kind of like halfway here, I wanna do another line. And I wanna do another rectangle shape and it's gonna pass a little bit the first one I did and it comes down and it joins here. It's here where we finish this line. We're gonna do a line that grows down like this. Now I wanna go close, really close to this side and I wanna go right and down. Now on the top, we're gonna go to the left. Mm -hmm. Now I'm gonna go down. Now right, down, right, down, and right. If you have room, we're gonna go from this corner to the rectangle shape, so we're just gonna go one line. Perfect. Let's draw the eyes. The eye on the right side is just a little square shape. In the middle, we're gonna do a rectangle shape that's gonna be kind of like the mouth. And the other eye is gonna be here. Look at it, it's gonna cross this line. Tangle crossing this line. We're gonna repeat this shape on top of here. And so we're gonna start like this. I wanna start here in the center. I wanna do one line, then I leave a space and I do another one. Good job. Now, let's start with the left side, left shape. So I'm gonna go left, up, left, up. Uh-huh, and then we're gonna go left one more time. And we're gonna go down two times. So I'm gonna go down, down, there you go. And then now right, down, and right. Good, so now we're gonna do the same thing in the other side, this time to the right. So it's gonna go right, up, right, up, right. 
Mm -hmm. And we're gonna try to, the, the, they, they are the same distance or the same level here, okay? Now let's go down, Mateo, let's go down, left, down, left. Perfect. These shapes are a little funny and they're probably a little hard to do. Uh, a couple tries, I'm sure you guys are gonna be awesome. We're gonna imagine this line is gonna cross in behind and it's gonna connect to this. So I'm gonna go from this corner, going in behind, and going in behind. Corner. Go up a bit. Yeah. Perfect. Now from this corner, you're gonna join it to this one. So we're gonna go like this. We're gonna do one shape like this one here. This is gonna be a short one. So I'm gonna start up, right, up, right. Uh -huh. And then I go down very close to the corner, just very close. And I stop and then I go left, down. Good job. Now let's do the body and the body is going to uh, behind. So we're gonna do a line that is gonna go, you can do it from this corner, Mateo, it's gonna go back. We're gonna go from this corner back like this. It's a long line. Probably extend a little bit of yours, just a little bit. Perfect. Now we're gonna go down, left, down left now let's go down one more time and this line is longer than the other ones oh i think this is a tail yeah it's a tail so now we're going to repeat the same shapes kind of you can start from this corner mateo and we're going to repeat the same shape so i'm going to go to the left and i stop a little sooner and then i go down left down left good now let's do a short, short line here, going down. Mm -hmm. And I wanna do a third line that goes to the left and this line is gonna stop on this corner. So it's gonna look like this. I wanna start from here and I'm going left. So you start from this point, left. Good job. Stop, uh-huh. And now we're gonna go down, passing this line. So I'm gonna go down and you see how I pass this line a lot? Err, perfect. Now let's join this last line, the longer line, oh, here's to a, here. Here's a tip. Do it at this corner. Yeah, that's a that's a very good tip, yep. So now we're gonna join these, which is the tail, to the square. Or if you don't want to, to use my technique, that is fine. <laughs> okay, now from this corner, we're gonna go to the square. So we're gonna go from here to here. Mine's squashed. <laughs> it's <laughs> fine. It's totally fine. Now we're gonna close the body. This is the body. So we're gonna close the body joint in this corner to this square. So it's gonna look like this. So it's rectangle shape. The last thing we're gonna do is two legs. Look at this. It's going out, going back, and come back. And the corner is inside the rectangle. Now let's do one more around this. Two, two rectangle shapes with it here, the same thing. I'm gonna do a rectangle. And now we're gonna do the, the fingers or the, the little feet. And then we're gonna go, it's like kind of a square shape, go around, but I'm not closing this square shape. Now I'm going out and I'm going down. It's kind of like three squares together. Uh-huh. And we're gonna do the same thing in the other feet or the other leg. And there, that's it. We finished this axolot, a Minecraft axolot. Axolot, right? Axolot. Yeah. <laughs> I can't believe one, my mom's better than drawing with me, but she's really bad with the names and I'm better with the names. <laughs> <laughs> Very funny. And now my favorite part is coming. Let's go, Lord. Okay, little artists, we are done. This is how 
<laughs> You're yawning. Yeah. <laughs> this is how our pictures turn out. Here we pick uh, three different tones of pink. One is really light, the other one is really bright, and another one is kind of like close to red, which is this one. And I just use this one uh, for putting some squares around it so it looks more and more Minecraft. Uh, and we have this bright pink for the kind of like the details around it. And actually, I think yours looks really much like Minecraft, but this one kind of looks like the axolotl's hand. Yeah, a little bit, right? Or if you think it's like a flower, that's fine. You think mine looks like a flower? Kind of. <laughs> okay. Well, well, or or the axolotl's foot. Hey, hey, you want to see mine? <laughs> Just kidding. No oh, man. So if you like this video, don't forget to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss lessons step by step and easy like this one. See you next time. Bye. See you later.